Uh, she's wearing a hijab and a T-shirt, uh, reading Salam, I Come in Peace. Our Jeff Jeleny is there. She joins us now. Tonight. A 56-year-old flight attendant who is a Muslim who lives in Charlotte. We spoke to her before the rally. She stood up during the rally when uh, Donald Trump was talking about Syrian refugees. She was not saying anything. It was a moment of, uh, of relative silence. And then suddenly, some people in the crowd around her sort of turned on her. And some police came, uh, forwarders, you can probably see this video here, and escorted her out. And my colleague Jeremy Diamond spoke to her afterward, and she said that she was very surprised by this. She said she came to this rally with the idea of uh, allowing Trump supporters to see what a Muslim looks like. Of course, there's been so much inflammatory rhetoric in the last several weeks, and Donald Trump has called for a ban on, uh, on travel for Muslims Muslims coming into the U.S. So she said she came to this rally in um, not far from Charlotte uh, just to see it, and mainly so Trump supporters could see her. But as you can see there, she made it about halfway through the rally, and she was escorted out. It was just one of several disruptions at this rally tonight. Of course, not as many as last night in Burlington, Vermont. But Anderson, it was an unusual moment, somewhat of an uncomfortable moment for someone sitting around her. And then some other people in this crowd uh, turned pretty ugly on her and uh, started uh, sh uh, shouting some uh, epitaphs and other things. So just one slice of an otherwise um, pretty boisterous Donald Trump rally here in Rock.